Hey guys, too bad here. Yeah, please murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. So far, so good for my first day on stream. I mean, on the job. <laughs> Working the trains, dining car can't be so bad. Come on, do me, shake it off. Shake it off. Get off. Get off me. Dubit, did I just see you hitting yourself? You hit me, you son of a... <laughs> Alas, today is my last day as conductor. I'm retiring after 32 wonderful years. Wow, I've done this most of my life. Goodbye, train. Goodbye, Dubit. You're not done yet. Yes, thank you. My wife is very excited about it. I miss my wife, Dubit. <laughs> Is a state-of-the-art, high-speed, smart train with all the latest gadgets and gizmos and doodads and... This train can handle anything you throw at it. Watch! I'm going to throw this explosive device! What's the event today? The Halloween stream, you doofus! Can I be the murderer? Doors to the Mirage Express are opening. All aboard! Oh no, it's the evil Nurkles. You know, I always go all out for my birthday party. Can't promise I won't take anything, though. Calm down there, Rouge. Did I not just catch you stealing from the train station gift shop? Don't make me arrest you. Hey, pal. Can I get one of those chili dogs? Okay, but if it turns out poisoned, I didn't do it. Oh, boy. It's crowded. Well, obviously, I'm gonna talk to the Dr. Seuss hand. Mmm, yummy, don't mind if I do! Tubit, those are for our guests! You're fired! <laughs> Train, be sure Tubit only gets one of those if they ask. May I offer you any of the stacks we have on board? How about some of our private stash of wine? He's eight years old, you! <laughs> no, thank you. When I travel, I always pack my own sparkle gelatin. Sparkly jelly that I can melt any cheated heart. Thank you, miss. Thank you for choosing our train. Uh, tip, please, before we move along, for you, miss. Oh, how fun! Where do I use this? Well, you can stick it up your... Door unlocks any door in the train. Happy birthday. Hey, I'm doing the lines. Follow the trail of crimes. Hey. Welcome aboard the Mirage Express. Okay. Do any of the chandeliers? No. <laughs> Good. We'll, we'll need today's weather. A word with the condemned. When Eggman took over, I truly feared the worst. But my kids swore you would swoop in eventually. And you did. I have kids now? <laughs> well, don't sweat a thing. Glad you and your family are safe. Got it use! <laughs> I hate the idea of a ticket lost in a load like this. It'll slow down my escape from this story. Do you sell gift bags here? Uh, no, sadly. But I have a plastic grocery bag in the back I could get for you. <sighs> Stare. So cold. My tube and you're shivering. Do you need to fetch me? Do you need to fetch you? Jackie, do you need me to get a sippy cup for you too, little baby? Can we get your ticket? And if you don't have a ticket, I have a personal room on this train that we can retire to. My, my, how forward. 8-Bit, 8-Bit, you have a wife. Ah, there it is. That's my ticket. Thanks so much to you both. He'd have his hands full kicking you out. He can't even lift this controller here. I can too. Noodle arms. A train. Assist to it if they need any help, won't you? I trust you completely, arm. Thank you all for following the outfit guide I sent you. You all look amazing. I trust you all read your lore cards as well. Sonic, you're a ship captain, and you'll be stationed in the conductor's car. Tails, you are the detective. I have a map for each of you. The murderer can kill a single participant however they choose. I'll set a timer for one hour so everyone can mingle and the murderer can do their thing. Is everyone ready? Shouldn't you two be out there mingling with everyone? Well, I 
Actually, the detective and the journalist can't be the murderer. You know what their character motivations are, Amy? No, the lore cards are confidential. No one knows but the person who received them. My backstory is that I was best friends with a flicky that decided to join the evil Dr. Eggman, kickstarting my desire for justice in the world. The train started moving! It's so fast! Grab onto something! No! Everyone all right? Yeah, my head's spinning a bit, but I'm okay. Seems we've been knocked into the dining car's closet. Then the door is obviously blocked. Check out everything you can around this closet. Then we'll show it to Amy to uncover the full situation. She's just got a spoon. Well, look at this mess. Let's uh, try to move this first. What how this side of the shelf got smashed. The toilet paper is fine. How about this? What's this, a rod? Tip is broken. Looks to have originally been attached to something. This is the end of the Pico Pico hammer. It's been wrecked. <laughs> I want to rifle through the trash. Empty. But on the bright side, this is a very clean trash bin. Wait a minute. You're gaslighting me, Tails. I can see stuff in it. I found a spoon! We find two more, we can dig ourselves out! Amy, we believe you're hiding something from us. That's right. You murdered a sus- Nah. Nah. You attempted to escape. Show me evidence that I attempted to escape or help me search for a way out. Really? We need both pieces of evidence, but this is probably the one they want first. How does the crack on the shelf relate to Amy? But what would Sonic do? Oh no, I must think. Oh, uh, I must really think. Okay. We need... Okay! We did it! We did it! I believe someone is responsible for hitting the shelf. What was the shelf hit with then? The menu. Now it was clearly Sticks the Badger. <laughs> Jump! Whoa! Ah! Okay, okay, we made it. This is actually the handle to your Pico Pico hammer! You're under arrest! So as you both said, I tried to get us all out with my hammer, but I failed. Well, lucky for you, I'm a detective, and I dabble as a mechanic. Let me see both pieces of the hammer. All right, stand back! The shelf completely shattered. Incredible! It's a piece of garbage! All right, we'll let you off the hook this time, Amy. Wait, is that...? Oh my god! He spilled the wine! Body numb can't move. <laughs> and remember, don't let our paying customers get murdered for real. soon. Hey Tails, where you at? Can't let anything happen to you. What if Sonic is actually hurt? Sonic doesn't go down so easily. He's on a train full of his friends. Nothing would actually happen to him. It's just my job to keep an eye on you. You just want to hang out with me, don't you? I can see it in your eyes. The last guy to work a case was me ditched our practice to join the evil Dr. Eggman. What are y'all doing in my saloon? We're wondering if you could tell us what you were up to before the murder. I have nothing to tell either of you. Decent cash reward for finding this robot. Maybe I'll keep an eye out. I knew it. I'm a chow's a criminal too. 
the trash. There's got to be something in the trash this time. Nope, this one's empty as well. Stupid. This one has lipstick on the rim. That's not Knuckles' color at all. Clearly, this is a clue. Uh, we're not gonna be able to play Super Monkey Ball. This is too frustrating for my taste. Well, howdy, partners! Thanks for watching the stream! The crime has been committed here. Please don't beat me up, though. Thankfully, we don't need you to say much. What happened here is pretty obvious. This could slow me down from beating the game a lot. Whoa! You are weak! Curse you, Knuckles. I've been pressing the button one by one by one. Knuckles, you clearly destroyed the arcade machine, but why? I'm on it! Do it! Destroy Knuckles while I fix Super Monkey Ball! Think about how not to die! Whoa! Whoa! We got the light bulb! The lunch menu's been playing the game. You competed with Vector to see who could get the highest score! And Vector beat you! <laughs> Vector's a common name! Prove to me he was here now! Vector's a common name? Really? First try! Yeah, right. <laughs> Vector was the one wearing the lipstick. <laughs> Don't tell me! I destroyed the machine! No proof of his win! Boy, this friend group has a lot of pride issues! Play Sonic Rivals sometime! <laughs> Rouge was in here too. She searched around for something but failed, made fun of our game and left. Are you not satisfied? Will you two not relent? Let's say toast, apple, bread... Oh-ho! Good old Tim! Vector and I were struggling so much with the game, but then Shadow dropped by. He taught us the game and was the first to get his name on the scoreboard. He gave me this before he left. Shadow told me to lock the door and not to open it for anyone, then he left. Alright. The case of the knucklehead closed. Fair enough. The library's in the next car. I'll open the lock for you. This is like the fifth library I visited this year on the channel. <laughs> Future level? No wait, Coliseum High? That was from Sonic Rivals. Ready to mosey down to the next car? You got it, partner. Alright, back to the library. This tip is just too juicy to ignore. See you all around. Don't worry, Sonic. I'll be the one to avenge you. And quick! Now, what are you two doing? Looking mighty suspicious, I say. I'm the detective, so I can't be the murderer. I'm Vector, the butcher. I'm licensed to handle raw meat. And I miss Pio, the poet. Teardrops in the spring. Can you hear me sing? La 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 la, dee 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 dee. Clap, clap, clap. <laughs> I promptly picked a book off the shelf and made myself comfortable. Vector got bored, so he left to see what Knuckles was up to in the saloon car. Rouge came over to the library car, seemingly looking for something. She came back shortly after. We heard her shout, No way! at the brochure stand over there. We're all keeping track of this, right? <laughs> Thank you both for your cooperation. We're just gonna peek around and we'll return with any questions. The most obvious clue is to hang in there, sign. Yes, you are a clue. This little chow's hanging in there, refusing to use his wings to fly to safety because choosing the hard way is often the most rewarding. Now you said there was nothing in the trash bin. I'm all right. I'm all right. Look at this. There's a couple maps here. Seems to be a map of the library car. Shadow left the library car. He locked this door on his way out. I sadly have no interest in picking up these books. But Rouge pulled a lot of these out too, searching for something. What reckless behavior. I feel sorry for the poor books. This kid feels empathy for everything. He's a precious boy. We must protect him. The book on these shelves is in alphabetical order, but this one. 
The user guide to the Mirage Express, the train we're currently on! Yep, this is Dr. Eggman's autobiography and recipe book. Maybe people just appreciate an omelet. You're sus, Vector. Bring me any meat to chop! You, you, you sussy crocker! Why did you leave the library car to visit Knuckles? We are prepared to present evidence of deed. Oh, that's easy, I got bored! Rouge entered the library car, found something, then left. You said you immediately started reading. But were you actually reading the entire time you were in the library car? Once Espio starts reading, he doesn't stop till it's done. I've seen it happen. What was the book? Ooh, obviously, it was Eggman's autobiography. Except it's not on the list. Okay, let's just try to survive from here. Stop attacking me, you. Ooh. All right. That is indeed the book I was reading. The Mirage Express Manual. Dreams are cool. Did you ask us you some questions about the manual? Just flip to a page and ask away. Robotic arms can also detect weapons or explosives being brought onto the train, ensuring passenger safety. At least Espio's easier on my throat than Vector. Clearly read the manual. Those answers feel far too specific to be guesses. Don't we want to be supporting folks who read? Yes, you are sus, Espio. You are sus, Bio. Vector was the only one to see me reading, after all. My alibi is hard to substantiate despite being the truth. Frankly, I don't believe that can be true. We have evidence to back it up. Oh, Shadow locked the doors. Right, right. Time to play video games. Oh, boy. Jump me over it. Oh, nuts. How much nastier is this gonna get? How am I supposed to? <laughs> Okay, got it. This Bio said he saw a Shadow enter the library car. He's mentioned nothing about Shadow's return. We know Shadow had to walk back through the library car when he left the saloon car. I was just fully immersed in my book. I didn't notice Shadow. Now when Espio leave, Shadow locked all the doors and no one saw Espio in the saloon car. It's a mystery, my dear Tubi. One that I would love for Espio to solve. When Vector returned, he even had to tap me on the shoulder to get my attention. If you weren't there for Shadow to see you reading, then how did you leave the library car? Two bits! Two bits! Protect the passengers aboard the train! All of them! Don't play favorites, you... You tail simp! Well, we gotta use this sometime. Hmm... This looks about right. That's where I was sitting reading my book. That confirms it then. You see, Shadow and Espio couldn't have seen one another from this spot. I apologize for losing my cool back there. Felt like I was grasping despite telling the truth. But you're both still suspicious as heck. Sadly, our work isn't done. I have plenty of questions for Rouge, and especially Shadow. Get him back, and if you need any meat chopped up, say the word. We're gonna actually need some meat chopped up at some point, aren't we? A murderer is on the loose, while doors keep getting locked. Tick, tock, goes the clock, while our heroes are in the caboose. Mystery beckons. The case is on. Alright, the casino. We've visited every train car so far, and everyone says they've seen you wandering about. My, my. Talk about a warm welcome. Quick to the point, aren't you, darling? All right. I've been hunting for a treasure rumored to be stored here on the train. Treasure? 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 What? It's a Fabergé chow egg. But please don't tell me you accepted Amy's birthday invite only to find that egg. A woman can have multiple goals. I deduce that the Fabergé chow egg is here, in this train car, locked in a safe. I can sell it, and I can retire from this gig. <laughs> I found the train's blueprints in the library car, with the safe code written right on it. The score of a lifetime. There's a problem. We need your assistance. 
Give me a plan to get that card to use the elevator. And our chance of success grows with everyone's help. Well, I suppose if both Blaze and Tubin are in... Okay, let's get that fabricate, shall we? You just have a whiteboard out of nowhere. Security guide has the access card. Do we? Oh, good. They made sure to draw me in my proper blue. All right. Now, obviously, we bribed the guard. I have a pair of tweezers. We kill the guard. Oh, yo, yo. Do you tell me you didn't ta attack your Chow guard and Chow at least once? We, we knew that we were going to have to distract him. Yeah, who's distracting the security guard? Of course I'll distract them. Who could resist my feminine charms? I'm not sure how effective your charms will be on a chow. Yes, ex exactly, Tails. Sure, I could be the distraction. I don't like the way he said that. Vito. No, 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 really? I couldn't do it? That's okay. I didn't want to leave you behind here anyway. All right. You can do it, Blaze, since you want to criticize everything. What's the distraction? Push a bunch of choker chips, bunker chips on the floor. I'll snatch the access key, no problem. That chow in uniform won't notice a thing. With the card of team, we need to get Blaze out of there. Do it. What's your plan? Wait. <laughs> then you'd be marrying into the royal family. What is your heritage? Any war crimes I should know about? Wait. This one's for me. I thought this was for. <laughs> We will lie. Absolutely vile. I can think of nothing worse. What do we do about the mechanical arms attacking from the ceiling? Finally, we will destroy them. Oh no! Tails is taking a while and the arms are tightening their grip. Suck it up. Let's see what's up that elevator. Our planning beforehand was very thorough. I must admit. And it was executed to perfection. Let's claim our Prabhuji Chowag. <laughs> Let's see. 23, 4, 1. Only three of these eggs were ever made, each hiding their own individual secret. No one knows the secret because anyone who's opened one of these has never lived to tell the tale. Rouge, I don't know if you should. All you need to do is twist it. Secret. Because he changed his own bomb! But what do we do? Where do I put this thing? That's an excellent question. Oh! Well, uh, see if this wires to cut. This isn't a movie, do it! This is real life! Just tell it to stop. Stop! I did nothing. I can't believe I just did that. Well,. I guess we're just gonna have to let it go. It's just, Espio did say something interesting when we quizzed him about the train's manual. The robotic arms can also detect weapons or explosives being brought onto the train. The egg! It opened! It's hollow! Not a bomb at all! Sega's got some new merch! <laughs> Final secret to the Fabergé Chow egg! It's a chow covered in gems. Stealing was strangely fun, but I prefer to never do it again. Let me unlock the door so you can continue forward. The capabilities of these robot arms are quite spectacular. I'm impressed every time we see them. But why is it gambling? Let us play the slots. Big money, big money. Well, nuts. We can't stop. Ready for some hold them? I don't know how to play that. Let me show you. Do it, we simply don't have time for this! Ah! The band car! It's inconceivable what you did! I'd also like to know why you've been locking doors throughout the train, Shadow. Well, it seems Amy already knows. So ask her. Now, if you could leave me be... I have an appointment coming up. All right, let us find our answers. Intuitively, my dear Tuit, 
First, we must see if Narnia is inside this wardrobe. Huh. Well, well, well. The back of the wardrobe opened. The train has a secret passage. Of course it leads to the library. Quick, back through the passage before they spot us. The trash can. No. Are you going to get sad again if there's nothing in the trash bin? What's this? Ha! Ha ha! Someone printed out the front page of a ticket website. It's for the band Hot Honey. Who cares what it is? The story arc is over. Then we print something. And he go. <laughs> what's he singing? Chat, what's he singing? Ah. Key ring. Must be Shadows. The locksmith. Please, little ditty, good show. Don't you look so cute in your little outfit? Don't make me launch you out of this train. Where were you on the night of October 27th? So Shadow was locking all the doors for one reason and one reason alone. To keep Sonic from escaping the conductor's car. He locked the conductor's car, then locked all the others so no one locked door was... So, so one locked door wasn't suspicious. I can talk! Well, my source can back up these claims. They will remain anonymous, but I think the point stands. Shadow did lock the door to the conductor's car imprisoning Sonic. And how was Sonic found in the dining car? The evidence. It is my crumpled up paper. Yep. Accusing Shadow of murder! Murder most foul! Then how did Espio and Victor not see him? Victor was with Knuckles. What about Espio? He's behind a bookshelf at a table reading. He is lying. I spent some time looking for Espio, but he wasn't there. If you must know, I needed to give him a key. Yeah. This is pretty obvious. Oh no! 60. Dang it! And then he just walks right between the springs. Ah, nuts! Well, we did it anyway! Those were the two keys Shadow meant to give us the old vector! Then what possible reason could he have for locking all the doors? Tubin and I know exactly why Shadow was locking all the doors. <laughs> why does he keep including me too? I'm canonically an idiot! I think Shadow was trying to keep Amy away. Show me the evidence! The evidence, clearly, is the trash paper. Oh no! You didn't see that. This is Hot Honey's website! No way! I love them! Their tickets are really hard to get! You have to be ready online at a specific time and they sell out in minutes! I've done a poor job hiding in the surprise, it seems. When I arrived on the train, I realized everyone else had a gift except for me. I knew I had to keep Amy away while I waited to buy the tickets, so I began locking all the doors. This key opens up any door on the train! Gotten through every locked door with ease! All right, the mystery of the locked doors is complete. We need to investigate one last area, the conductor's car. I'll come with you. I'd love to know who's been dragging my name through the mud. All right, the conductor's car. Come on, time to investigate. Crack, crack, crack on, okay. Microphone, we can talk the whole train with this. If you can hear this, you stink. My armpits certainly do not! They're clean! 
This is a twist. We thought the arm was the murderer, but it's been murdered. A mint. The large one. Seems like at least one person could fit through. Wait, what's this? That's not a throwing dart. That's a blow dart. Someone brought a weapon onto this train. Hello, everyone. This is the birthday girl speaking. Please report to the conductor car at once. Okay. Is everyone here? Why hasn't Sadik showed up? He has actually been murdered! He must still be pretending to be dead, lazy bum! Let's go get him! Ah! Dun dun dun! That's Amy's voice! Oh no! She's been murdered next! We are all going to be murdered! Why isn't he moving? He's banged up. If there is a pulse, it's weak. Set him down, Vector. Make sure his head is propped up. I'll help you. <laughs> I can't go from Espio to Shadow. I knew one of you would take this too far. Could this really have been one of us? There's no one else here, Knuckles. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to expose the monster who did this. He really was hurt the whole time, and I did nothing for a month. Or two, depending on when you're watching this. Who in this room did this? Who killed Sonic the Hedgehog? And basically everybody had an alibi except for Blaze and Espio. We decided Espio was the one with secret passage access. I did no such thing, my young friend. But if it's a battle of wits you wish, I would love to discuss things. Espio could have left at any time because Tails and I found a hidden passage from the library car to the lounge car. It makes sense. How was I to know about the hidden passage? It's hidden. Rouge, we need to see those blueprints. Whatever, I've already used it to scout for more treasures. Came up cold. Espio could have easily used this to find the hidden passage. Where'd you find the blueprints? Oh, uh, the library car. It was stuffed with brochures. So that means Espio had time to find the blueprints and discover the hidden passage. It's foolproof. Foolproof, I tells ya. I murdered Sonic. How did I do it? The blow dart. Oh boy. Now, the miserable part. But since I'm sick of this, I have set myself to Invincible, Haft, the amount of rings needed. We are just going to breeze through this because screw these sequences. I believe SPO used this to knock Sonic unconscious. Sonic might just be knocked out? According to Amy's rules, a blood art counts as a kill for the murder mystery. My theory, therefore, is plausible. Plausible, you say? Then... Why are there so many holes in it? If I knocked out Sonic in the conductor's car, then how was Sonic found in the dining car? I locked all the doors, and Espio didn't have a key. He would have had to take the hidden passage back. If he took the hidden passage back, he'd end up in the library. Well, I guess we'll take a look at the blueprint. Think, Sonic! Think! Think! And do not fall down the pits, because the pits are still death. There's a path above the conductor car. It goes all the way to the dining car. Specifically. Oh, wow. That's hella convenient. Perhaps you can access it. Through the vent over there. There is a path back there. And a track. And a swimming pool. A track for the robot arms, I think. Tails, you're a smart kid, so I know you realize we both couldn't fit up there. Well, this is the only thing left that we have. Really, a fight broke out here, and one of these robot arms was a casualty. It was murdered, I tells ya! What if one of the robot arms actually caught Sonic? Robot arm could have grabbed Sonic, passed out from a blow dart, and carried him to the dining car. Sonic doesn't fall easily, but if he's woozy from a blow dart, the arms could have gotten him. I might not be able to link everything directly to SBO yet. I found one inconsistency. What kind of inconsistency? Someone here received false information, and I believe that information came from SBO. It was you, Tails. <laughs> Me? I'm too smart for that. 
Espio lied to me. Espio told me Shadow was locking doors to trap Sonic. That scoop came from you, Espio. Prepare to die. I said, uh, Sonic's going to get trapped with all these locked doors. And now you're lying to me. I'm my best day, all days, even though I deliberately set it up so that someone was supposed to lie to me. When examining everyone's alibis, one clearly stands out as the weakest. It's Blaze. It was you, Espio. You were the one who murdered Sonic the Hedgehog. You wanted to take control of the franchise and be the new main character. Brains. Brains. Espio was the murderer! I thought it was that chili dog that that conductor gave me. Now wait, there's something important. Espio left me there. The train's a bad nick. We all need to get off this train. We're not safe. The train's powered by a flicky. Wow, this is suddenly going dark. Uh, I don't want to be the damsel in distress. You're doing the voice anyway. He Sonic did the murder of the arm. <laughs> There's the larger picture here. Who instructed those arms to attack? The train itself is plotting something. Once again, you keep saying the most ridiculous nonsense. I believe nothing. Nothing. Train! Come on and show yourself! <laughs> you two do? Uh, yeah, son of a... I'm taking all of you to Eggman's base. Eggman? The conductor and I will be free to laugh and play games, ride the open rails like we always planned. The train's picking up speed. Ha 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 ha. Can't keep my footing. Ah! No need to yell, bud. I'll never get this whole thing recorded. Yeah, things aren't looking the brightest. Those arms are still at work. Ah, it's attacking me. Yeah, oh, that's... That's interesting. <laughs> you got some nerve showing up here, Egghead. Seems you've finally taken passage on one of my passenger trains. You own the train? Who the heck are you? Don't talk to me! I converted some cargo trains into passenger trains for the sake of the public. It's just more useful for future schemes. Another death egg, Dr. Predictable? The people fear giant spheres! It's science! Judging by my security cameras, your pathetic friends are all locked in the cars they were stationed in. This train's capability of intellectual thought is extraordinary! A feat wholly accomplished by my genius. So I instituted a bounty upon my army of badniks. That's right, just like Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog. I deserve a promotion. The train wanted a reward. When you're dragged to my base, you'll regret the day you ever crossed me, Hedgehog. I already do. Get lost. I need you helping me think through this before I do something rash. Like, blow up the train with all of us in it! Believe in yourself, Tails! Wait, here, stand back! Go your best! Boom! I can grab enough rings, I should be fast enough to bust through the next door, too! Boom! Just wait till I see Eggman, I'm gonna clobber him! I shouldn't be able to lose this, but... Let's, let's pretend we're playing it properly. You all came for us. After all the bad poetry I said, the train wants to take us prisoner and earn a reward. My reward is to get off this stupid train. It's about time. I thought you were supposed to be fast, Sonic. And you a lot of exposition. Bam, Lemo. They locked Amy and Tails in the conductor car. Tails, I'm coming. Sonic, Sonic, you here? This is no way to treat the birthday girl! Excellent work trapping these pests! Now hurry to me! Just don't teleport us to the future! Teleport you all? 
move to the future when I've already ruled the planet. Sure, I'll do that, whatever. I will not fail. My wish will be granted. I don't care what you call it, just bring me those overgrown mammals. We're taking this thing down. Oh no, it's an actual boss fight. None of you could possibly understand. How could he just leave like it was nothing? The conductor? Eesh. You no stalkery over eating? You can't force someone to be friends with you. That's messed up. It's a good thing I have this on auto win mode, otherwise it's, I might get screwed up. My wish, my wish, my wish. Why would he betray me? Ah! This is a long one. When I told you we'd be with each other forever, there was a much, much younger man with a different voice actor. Excuses. How dare you abandon me? I'll be lonely. So lonely. Wait, no, stop! What are you doing to me? I didn't agree to anything like this! Oh! Bam. So did Sonic really go outside? I thought this was just kind of a symbolic thing. Whee! This is just like the lore card. When my ex-best friend left detective work to join Dr. Adrian. Let's show our full power. This is just devolved. It's no longer a point-and-click adventure. It's, a, it's just an endless runner now. At least this one has a, an end to it, actually. Whoa! So much is going on! Just be delivered to Eggman already! How? How dare you! Let's not panic! Let's not panic! Two train! No! One bit. <laughs> it's over! Turn the paper ruining my birthday! Whoops. <laughs> Wait, are we still on board? You killed me! More importantly, you killed Apeit! And yourself! Getcha! I just... Ugh, couldn't bear to see you go. You've set a new record for world's creepiest hand. I'll never forget how you tied me up and... <laughs> okay, Apeit. We've arrived back at the same station. This universe has a unique way of doing things. Oh, come off it. Eggman Nega would do the same thing. And I'm out of a job. I'll have to become a YouTuber. Who do you eat? We've been waiting for hours. Yeah, who is this? I'm just glad you're here. Quick, we leave for Spigonia in the morning. And you need to pack. Who are you saddling me up with, stupid? You pay for this. Oh, who's this? Hello, I want to be Dick Freaky. I become a freaky! Freak, freak, tweet, tweet! If only you could have seen me, Sonic! I was finding clues, presenting evidence, poking holes in alibis! Sonic? Wait, where'd he go? The station has a bakery! And look what I bought! They just naturally had this with your picture on it! I think you should sue someone, Amy! Happy birthday, Amy! Happy birthday! Can I go now? You are my sweet! Ah! I admire your tenacity. May you never lose your vivacity. Happy birthday to Amy and her sparkling personality. SBO, stop it. <laughs> I wouldn't trade these adventures for anything. Never in a million years. Now let's have some cake. I hope it's chocolate. Better not be strawberry. It looks like strawberry. Ugh, strawberry shortcake. Blah. That train's never making it here, is it? Robot, prepare a path! The happy rubber duck or the angry one? ANGRY! Sarge! 
choice, your evil list! Show it! <laughs> Have a good day, guys! Take care! Bye-bye!